good morning students today we are going to learn percentage okay so let's see percentage means out of 100 so this chapter already discussed in the class 5 now again we will repeat it again so the percentage means out of 100 suppose if I write they are suppose uh, 78 by 100 so 100 denominator is 100 and if in, in numerator written 78 suppose there is 78 then this one is this one this 78 if I write this 78 okay and this one is out of 100 so this out of 100 symbolically will show this one is percentage okay so this percent that means this 100 this is called percentage or percent okay suppose uh, suppose you uh, you got in your maths exam suppose out of 100 if you got suppose you got 92 in your math subject okay so someone asking you what person you got in maths then what you will say 92 percent because out of 100 you got 92 okay so this percent in bold from there you see this 100 now you will write this one is percentage symbol so now how much got out of 100 92 percent if you say 92 percent then we will understood this one is out of 100 you got 92 ok so percentage symbol is a percentage denoted by the symbol percent now we will understood this chapter with some exam exercise question ok so see some exercise question question number 1 express each of the following fraction as percent so in class 5 already we discussed how to convert um, fraction number into percentage and decimal number into percentage and how if you uh, if you convert any number into percentage then you just multiply this number by 100 so see their first question a here 7 by 100 written so this one is already given 7 by 100 means out of 100 there is 7 so directly you write 7 percent because according to question what written uh, uh, following as a fraction okay fraction as percentage there some fraction is given to you so you have to write into percentage so there is 19 by 100 so this one is a fraction so you have to write into percentage from because their denominator 100 is given so you can write directly 19 percent okay so number c you can do because 117 by 100 written now number d so already i told you if you want to convert into percentage then any if any number suppose fraction denom and decimal then you just multiply by 100 so here i will multiply by 100 okay you see 1 by 100 1 by 10 is there 1 by 10 then if you you so what we will do 1 by 10 will write first ok then this one will be multiplied by 100 now we have to convert into percentage right fraction is a percent that means you have to convert into percentage form ok so if you multiply by 100 and then outside of the bracket you give percentage symbol this is the way of uh, convert fraction or decimal into percentage form so here 1 by 10 written into 100 written now if i cut just 0 0 then it will be 1 and 10 now it is you see what percent 10 percent okay so hope you understood this one now similar you also same like that so first you write 3 by 5 then you give hundreds and one bracket you give 
and inside this bracket these things only write and outside bracket you give percentage sign because you have to write into percentage form okay so now you cut 5 1 ja 5 and this is 100 when 520 ja this one if you cut then 520 ja 100 okay now there remain what 3 into 20 so if you multiply and then you give percentage symbol okay then if you multiply this one then 320 ja how much 60 okay now 60 percent now question number f g h i j okay this one try to do it yourself at home okay now i'll show you question number k so you see there is question number k this one also very simple here this one is given in fraction from so we'll convert first this fraction into improper fraction so first 5 1 is 5 plus 1 what 6 so it is 6 by 5 now we have to convert into percentage so just multiply this one by 100 and outside the bracket you give percentage symbol okay now if we cut this one by 5 1 is 5 and this one is 100 520 is 100 okay now in numerator what have 5 6 into 20 so 6 into 20 in denominator 1 have okay so no need to write so now give percentage symbol now 620 is how much it will be what 620 is 120 okay so this is 120 percent okay so i think you will understood this all so now next this one is yes this is similar to k okay now question number two what have uh, express each of the following percent as fraction into lowest term so here you see percent as fraction so here percent is given to you you have to write into fraction and its lowest term okay so they are 15 percent given so first and you write percentage no so first you write into fraction from this 15 percent that means out of 115 so first you write 15 by percentage out of 100 so first you write 15 percent okay in solution 15 percent then 15 by 100 first you write here 100 in denominator 100 and uh, numerator here will be 15 okay now it is in fraction form right okay i write in fraction no need to write it also because uh, this one is fraction from you know and but according to question here written percent is percent as a fraction and after what what in its lowest term then we will convert into lowest term how you will cut if you cut this number by 5 then you see that 15 by 100 written uh, now we will cut by if I cut by uh, 5 then this will be 3 and then if you cut by 100 then it will be 20 so now it is in the lowest form right so 3 by 20 so right 3 by 20 ok hope you understood this question number 2 a now b is similar like that c also similar like that d also same e also same so e1 i will show you so here you see 6.5 percent written first 6.5 will convert into fraction so 6.5 so after decimal how many digits are there one digit so we'll remove this decimal now write 66.5 percent in the solution 6.5 percent and next line give equal to sign then 6.5 will convert into fraction okay first so 6.5 after decimal how many digits are there one digit so first will give in denominator 10 okay now we'll remove this decimal okay now this percentage is symbol there so percentage become 100 in it will write in denominator okay
because out of 100 6.5 and 6 point okay now we will cut this first we multiply by this 100 into 10 then it will be 1000 now there is 65 okay then this 65 because in lowest term we have to convert into lowest term also so if i cut this one is then by 5 then it will be 13 so 5 13 just 65 now if i cut this one one here is 1000 so there will be 200 okay 200 5 ja 1000 so it is now in the lowest form so now it is 13 by 200 okay okay now f so now it is in the form of a uh, mixed number right so first we mix number convert into improper fraction so how 316 the how much 48 and 48 plus 2 how much 50 right so 50 and parts 50 and their percentage symbol is there so this percentage will write in the denominator into 100 okay out of 100 no that's why so now it is you see there is 50 5 0 0 you cancel it okay then 5 1 ja 5 and 5 2 ja 10 now in denominator now what have denominator have 3 and 2 the 3 into 2 and numerator only 1 have so you write 1 so now now 3 1 ja uh, sorry 3 2 ja there will be 2 and 3 2 ja 6 1 by 6 so in the lowest form and fraction also now question number g g h i j this is similar like that so you can do g h i J and so it is also similar. Uh, your percent uh, decimal given first you convert into what into fraction form, then percentage is there, then you write in denominator percent. Now this one, so here is 0 0.25 percent, and then this one is F 66 2 by 3 percent. So, uh, first I will show you this uh, one. So, 66 2 by 3. So, we will convert into improper fraction. So, 66 into 3, how much? First to convert into improper fraction, there is 198. So 198 plus 2 what? 200. Okay. 200. So now percentage is given. Write this one into in the denominator. 100 because out of 100, this percentage means 100. Okay. So now this 0 0 you cut. They are 0 0 you cut. Then remain what? 2 by 3. So this is the lowest form and fraction also right so hope you understood question number two now see question number three what it in express each of the following percentage as decimal now we have to convert this percentage as a decimal so you see here 50 percent given so 50 percent means out of 150 so first we'll write 50 then this percentage will come in denominator 100 okay now see uh, we have to write into decimal form right so here in denominator how many zeros are there two zeros that means before two digit we have to give decimal so here you write 50 and how many zeros are there in denominator two zeros so two before two digit you see there then answer will be 0 0.50 okay so two digit is what 0 5 mm, that means 50 now question number b it is similar like that question number a now see here mixed fraction is given to you right so first to we'll convert this mixed fraction in fraction into improper fraction so 12 to ja what 24 plus 1 25 and their percentage symbol given then you write the numerator it will be 100 okay now we have to write in the decimal form right so first uh, we divide this 25 by 2 
here I will show you there you see first I will write 25 because we have to convert into decimal form so now 2 how many times in 25 2 12 ja 24 so here we will write 12 ok now 25 by 4 is what 1 and now you give this 2 how many times in 1 0 times so, so if I add if I write uh, yes if I give 0 there then in the quotient we will give one decimal sign right now it is 10 now 2 how many times in 10 5 times so here 5 to the 10 now answer is what here quotient is 12.5 so first we will write here because 25 by 5 ok now here we write 12.5 and denominator what remain 100 ok then mm, there remain 100 25 by 2 here quotient came what 12.5 now here 100 remain now see there how many zeros are denominator have 2 zeros now from 12.5 point will remove again the left side two digit left ok so now it will be how many zeros from 12.5 12 12.5 this decimal will come in before two digit where well, there ok so now will give zero point 1 to 5 will write first then before to uh, now from there 2 digit that means now total 3 digit before came ok hope you understood this one so this way will convert into decimal form ok e f also same similar like that so if here 105 percent f you see 105 percent so you write in denominator what 100 so here how many zeros two zeros that means before two digit we have to give decimal so first you write one zero five okay and before two digit then once tens th there will be you give decimal so it is 1.05 since this now it is similar like question c so 7.4 then first you will convert into fraction 7.4 that means after decimal how many digit 1 digit so you write in denominator 10 ok if it is 2 digit then you will write 100 so now here percentage symbol ok this is similar like that so percentage is given so 100 and then now we multiply this 100 into 10 then it will be 1000 now see 74 so 74 by 100 ok you see if their denominator only 100 1000 1000 is there then no need to cut ok if we want to convert into decimal directly you put uh, the zeros you see how many zeros are three zeros so before three digit three digit you have to give decimal so if 100 is not there then you have to divide it ok now it h also same like that i also j also k also l also ok now see question number four express each of the following decimal as percent so i already told you you have to convert into percentage from any number then you have to multiply it by 100 so it is decimal form given so what we will do in solution you write 0 0.23 percent 0 0.23 so you have to convert into percentage so this one what you will do you, will, you have to do multiply it by 100 so 0 0.23 into 100 okay and outside you give percentage symbol ok now if you multiply 23 into 100 0.23 into 100 then it will be 23 0 0 and now before how many digit decimal is there 2 digit before 2 digit you have to give decimal symbol and percentage sign you give now after decimal 0 0 is there there is no meaning so you directly write 23 percent ok is very easy right so b also same so now c d it is all similar like that now e i'll show you there you see 0 0.003 percent 003 written not percent so first you will uh, write this one uh, 
just uh, first you write 0, 0, 003 into then you write multiplied by 100 because you have to convert into percentage so if you um, you have to convert into percentage from then you multiply by 100 and outside percentage symbol you give now see you they are 0, 0, 003 you, if you multiply then then it will be 300 okay now how many digit before decimal three digits so from once place the uh, decimal will come before three okay now three digit before decimal put right and percentage symbol you give okay and there you give zero okay now there after uh, three point three there zero zero is written then you can write also zero point three percent no problem now h i j k homework now question number five express each of the following ratios as percentage now there are ratios given in curse 5 you got ratio so now here 5 is to 8 written this ratio you can say is to okay so 5 so first one you write in numerator and then this one you write second one you write in denominator okay same thing we have to convert into percentage then what you will do we have this one you multiply by 100 and outside the bracket you give percentage symbol okay then you multiply by 100 okay now percentage symbol you give will give percentage symbol now you see you can cut this 8 and 100 if you cut this one by 2 then it there will be 4 and if you cut this one by there will be 50 52 ja 100 again you will cut this by 2 then there will be 2 and then there is 25 25 to the 100 and there is 2 to the 4 so now here what have in numerator 5 in the in numerator have 5 in denominator write 2 and numerator 5 into 25 what will write 5 into 25 okay so if i uh, now percentage symbol is there so you give percentage symbol okay now 525 how much 125 okay and denominator what have 2 and percentage so here according to question this percentage right so if you write into more then 125 it is uh, you convert into mixed fraction okay how you know how to convert into mixed fraction so you divide by this to 2 6 that 12 and there remain 5 then 2 how many times in 5 2 times the so 2 to the 4 now quotient is 62 then 62 and denominator will be 2 and your quotient is 1 right so there your percent is give then it is 62 1 by 2 percent right so b is same like that c also same like that d also same like that e is also same f also same so i think you can do this one so now i'll show you the question number d so it's 20 by 100, 21 by 100 first 21 ratio 100 you can say 21 is to 10 so again you multiply by 100 because you have to convert into percentage any number if you want convert into percentage then you multiply by 100 and outside the bracket you give percentage symbol okay so here 10 10 cut uh, then you here remain 21 into 10 so it will be 210 percent okay and rest ef do by yourself now question number six what written express each of the following percent as ratio ratio okay so here 12 percent right so 12 percent means 12 by 100 so we'll write 12 by 100 okay so we'll cut this 12 by 2 then there will be 6 and there is 50 okay 50 to 100 again we'll cut by 2 then there will be 3 and again you might cut by 2 then it will be 25 now here what have numerator 3 and denominator 25 and question written what into ratio so first uh, numerator will write first 3 and ratio that's why you, you these two symbol you give this one is ratio symbol so now 3 is to 25 
okay now this percentage ratio form okay now this is all similar like that b c d e f so hope you understood if you have any problem then you ask me